in us this morning with more is Mawani Wright Van Alst, Communications Resource Manager for HMSA. Good morning. Thanks for coming in this morning. Good morning. Thank you. So, wow, ninth year, and it's getting seems like it's getting bigger and better in the quality of these videos. Oh, it's amazing every year what these students produce from middle through high school too. I mean from seventh grade these kids are producing amazing video even doing animation nowadays which i'm like i would never have been able to do that when i was in <laughs> school <laughs> so what's uh, what's happening this year it's, it's same kind of categories what are we looking yeah, at so we have four categories addiction prevention healthy living uh, mental health and teen safety and so we give broad categories so that the students can tell us really what are the health issues that are impacting them and their peers um, last year some common themes that we had seen were um, bullying. Bullying is still a hot issue among our keiki and I mean they're talking about texting bullying on social media, phone calls, um, and then another one was of course what impacts drugs have on your life for the long term. So uh, it's really great to hear what is really important to our children every year. Yeah, we learn something from them through these awards. Absolutely. So what are the judges looking for when, when they're looking at these? Yeah, they're looking for um, obviously a great message that you fall in the, the category and you're telling an important health message. And then obviously creativity, production, you meet the basic um, qualifications of 27 second PSA because the winners we actually do air on TV afterwards so we want to make sure it meets the time requirements as well and there's actually some awards for like best actor yes and <laughs> we just started that to make it a little more red carpet friendly <laughs> so we have best actor um, best um, video or best music mm. original music because we do get some of those um, and those are always fun and so even if you don't get a first, second or third place prize, um, money prize, you still get recognized for your work. And the award ceremony itself is actually a lot of fun. It really is almost like a very Oscar type kind of ceremony. Yes, the kids dress up. We definitely, <laughs> we roll out the red carpet. We take pictures of them uh, with a big backdrop as if they really are on having an Oscar night. Um, so it's, it's a lot of fun and there's great money involved too in the prizes for the school. So uh, we have first, second and third place prizes in all the categories and it's $1,000, 500 and 250 which goes to help buy video equipment for their school. So it, it helps their program every year. Terrific. So the deadline is upcoming. It is on March 4th to submit your, um, your videos. You can go to hmsa.com slash TVA for more information. Um, and we also have a public voting, actually. So from April 1st through the 12th, we want people to go to hmsa.com slash TVA and vote for your favorite video. Terrific. And really, you should check these out because these videos are pretty incredible. Some of these kids are just very talented. Very. Mawani, thanks so much for coming in this morning. Great contest. And we'll wait to hear over the uh the results. Yes, thank you. <laughs> so we'll see you again. Yeah. And to view this interview again or to watch any of the segments on our morning news, just check out this uh, the, this morning section on KITV.com. It's 717. We'll be right back.